Hey everyone, Servo here, and welcome back to Dragon Age 2. Okay, oh yeah, that's right, I talked to, uh, Uncomfortable Crown Man, and he wanted me to do some things, and I had a whole bunch of... That's not what I wanted. Uh, a whole bunch of quests with my friends. My friends. Varric. Anders, F you, Aveline, Venris, Venris again, Ugh, Isabella, and Errol. <sighs> Who do I want to talk to? And do I want to do this? There's a lot of friends. There's a lot of friends. Oh, you know what? I should have my house, though. Like, that was the thing, right? I had to wait. No, oh god, I'm in Pajama Man's room. I don't think I can do this. I can't do that. I didn't think so. Bye, Pajama Man. Bye. Uh, how You're do I... looking well, Sarah. Wow. That was aggressive. Make how do I get out of here? Yes. How, 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 how... Are these doors? I am so lost in this room. There we go. Yes, thank you. Good day to you, Sarah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm cool now. Yeah. Oh, Aveline hangs out Good here. Day, Maybe I should just go talk to Aveline? No, I don't want to talk to Aveline first. I'm gonna go talk to Varric. Oh, okay. Oh, there you are. I can't tell you guys apart. I'm sorry. I've been looking everywhere for you, Miss Air. If only you humans didn't all look the same. Same for you. Oh, oh, I can say that. <laughs> we can't all be short and bearded like your people, Bodan. Oh, he was the guy on the, the deep roads thing with me, with the weird son. It's quite son. a shame, really. Uh, there, there's a, a, a gentleman waiting at the mansion. Which mansion? He on seeing you. He says his name is Dougal. Dougal. Your mother thought he wise, I tell you, Monsieur. I paid Dougal years ago. Why would he be back Oh, wait, now? is he the guy I... He wouldn't tell me, I'm afraid. ...got money from? He refused to come back another day, even after I told him repeatedly that I didn't know when you would return. I've been back for three years. It doesn't really seem like the most reputable sort, I'm afraid, even for a dwarf. Uh... You left him alone in the mansion with Mother. My boy Sandal is oh, with Oh, good. Her. He's useful. But, uh, you make a good point. I'll run back right away. Uh, before I go, may I simply say how grateful I am that you've allowed my boy to stay in your home. He lives with me. I said I would repay you for saving Sandal's life, and I shall serve you faithfully. Wait, did these guys both it live with me? It is good to know he is safe. This is weird. No. I didn't ask you to be my manservant, Bodan. But I owe you a debt, and after what happened in the deep roads, I don't want you to live with me. To repay you. I'll leave you to your business. But don't forget about your guest. Your mother claims he was high in the silverware. Okay, so I get to go to my house first anyway. Uh. I can't keep track of all these dwarves. They do look the same. I'm sorry. Nothing new today. Dwarf racist. I mean, I thought that guy Worthy was... How did I get up here? That dwarf named Worthy, I thought his name was Anso, because they look really, really similar. What's this? I don't know. Good day. That's nice. What? What you... Oh, this is my house. Yeah! Why do these guys live with me? It's uncool. <laughs> my bow is huge. <laughs> Puppy. And a loot. Some scrolls. That guy. Why do you live with me? Please, please don't live with me. Okay, get it. It's grandiose. Who are you? Oh, that's me! Okay, I was like, I'm in a different outfit. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, hey, Evelyn. What's up? You've settled in I just nicely. chill in my dressing gown. It's just luck. And skill. 
Indeed. Still, more coin than I've been hearts, here right? for three years, haven't I? Say, if someone wanted to pass some work your, your way... Your armor's cool. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm listening, Aveline. What's the trouble? A thorn in my side inventing trouble and scaring people. Remember Emmerich, the Templar? Yep. He wants your help. And some sort of official sanction. Why does everyone want my help? Official sanction? For his investigation. He's convinced that every random murder in the past few years is connected. I agree. And he won't be quiet. Actually, because they are all really shady. Yeah. Seems like it should be easy to prove if there well, are bodies. there's not always bodies. Kirkwall isn't the safest place. That doesn't mean everything terrible is related. There's no sense to that. Okay, your armor's Can't cool, be. but your ascot is silly. Boop. You don't think it's worth investigating? I have. He even convinced one of my lieutenants to raid the Dupuy mansion. Dupuy. Nothing there. You wouldn't believe how much ass I had to kiss after <coughs> that. Bloody hobbyist constable. Are we friends now, by the way? Why I don't even know. spend his declining years building a boat or something? Um, I don't remember the original... Whatever. Mazel the geezer. Got it. I would never say that. <laughs> but if it leads somewhere genuine, I'll pick it up on your word. If he shuts up, that's good too. He's in the gallows. Thanks, Hawk. I appreciate it. Okay. So much stuff to do. Uh, okay. Do I talk to this Dougal dude now or what? Hello. Oh, yeah. Why, hello again. Lovely home you have here. And may I say your mother makes for delightful... Why did I get in my dressing gown to talk to you? Another visitor. We've moved up in the world, mother. Evidently so. My apologies, Sarah. Your son and I simply have a bit of business to conclude. Apparently I paid you. I'll leave you two alone, then. Be careful. That was a sick Darling look. Darling woman. A shame that she spends so much time here alone. Just what are you saying? Allow me to get right to the point. I know all this came from Deep Road. No, it treasure. didn't. It's mine. I know you repaid me, but I think I deserve a larger share of your fortune. No, F off. Fair's fair, right? Yeah. I kept my end of the bargain. Now get out. Pity. I don't owe you anything. Have it your way, Hawk. We'll be seeing each other again. I'm sure. I'll murder you. Like, straight up. In my dressing gown. I already paid him. This was my house. You don't get nothing. F off. Just no. Let me look at my house. Is there anything to loot inside my house? Why do I have a giant beer barrel? Do I just come over here and just tap some of this? Like... Okay, what else is in my house? Nothing up here except a giant beer barrel. Got a little library and stuff, table stuff. What's in here? There's quests over here. Oh, okay, ordering things. This is a picture of somebody. What is this? That's mother's room. I shouldn't intrude. Okay, thank you. It's weird running around in my dressing gown. Is this my room? Nothing in here. Maybe I'll just talk to Fenris, because he lives right next door to me. Take finery! Okay. Do I have to, like, put myself in better clothes? Is that what's going on? Like... Like, okay, no, I still have all this stuff equipped. I'm just not wearing it. Look at my shoes. <laughs> uh, you're do, 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 at least I got a better house. I do, puppy, hi, puppy. I like the doggy. That's good. It's almost as big as you. Rock, rock, rock. Oh god. I know he's playing, but that's horrifying. Aw, your boobie. 
<laughs> Looks like they're having a nice chat. <laughs> Maybe Sandra picked up some Mabari speak from our time at the hero of Ferelden's camp. Mabari can understand us, though. I got a puppy. Okay. Uh, storage. Oh, yeah, that's just stuff I put in here. Don't need that. Uh, what is this? Do I still get letters? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ariani. Should I know who Ariani is? Oh, wait, isn't she, like, Fenril's mommy? Oh, yeah, okay. Fenril. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Uh, okay, bad stuff with him. Accept a quest. Oh my god. Terry of Starkhaven. Starkhaven, Starkhaven. Wait, those were where the mages went? Or they were from? In that quest with the guy who, like, freaked out and killed everyone? Fine, accept it. Hey, a note from this guy. Uh, except... Oh my god, so many things. What? What? Is this like Dragon Age Viagra? I, it, I'm not accepting that. I think I'm okay. Uh, saving daughter... Was this the elf? Yeah, that was the elf guy. Okay. Uh, except... Oh my god. Why am I doing this? Oh, this is the kid I helped. Okay, cool. Strangely official looking letter. Lord Akim, folk of Starkhaven. Uh, oh god, what is this? What is this? Sorry, Royal Highness Prince Corby and Vale. Isn't that related to that guy from the DLC? Sebastian or whatever? The details in the open bank account. In what are you, some Nigerian prince? I don't even know. Okay. Should go a lot of the free marches. Really? Spiders? Yeah, there's lots of spiders. This is nice. Okay. Leandra, who is this from? Miriam. I don't know who that is. Okay, Carver, blah, blah, blah. You're in Redcliffe. Oh, hey. Redcliffe was in Origins. Uh, sure. I read my mom's letter. I heard there's my name. Oh, this is from Bethany. Oh, Bethany. Okay, at least you're doing well. This one is amusing. Why is this a quest? I'm going to accept it just because that new quest, a bajillion things, right? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Oh, actually, not that many. Oh, wait. They're all second. Wait. Actually, okay, I accepted a million things, and I didn't actually get that many. I don't know what to do. There's so much to do. Emmerich, whatever. Um, this was Fenrir. Fenrir. Mistress Selby. Help apostates and Kirkwall. Well, Fenris will not come to me. Let's talk to Fenris, because he lives right next to me. That's all I can do in here. Well, I see two little points. Oh, oh, it's these things. You know, like grenades. What do I do with grenades? If I leave, am I gonna like put on some clothes? Oh, okay, I did. Okay, okay. Well, Fenris lives next to me, but come with me anyway. I can't bring Bethany, but I can see her. Uh, wh whatever, whatever. I'm just going to talk to Fenris. I uh, don't know. You've certainly come a long way, Hawk. Thank you, Aveline. Fenris can level up. Let's do it. Okay, let's go talk to Fenris. Where does he live? I forget. He lives really near to me. Oh, well, he's not that near. 
Uh, okay, so I'm going to go straight, and then I'm going to go left. You do not like your name. What? My name is a wish my father made, and I did... You're quite welcome. Okay, I did not hear that entire conversation. My my character like party dialogue things are so bugged. Like when Isabella randomly just said a line from somebody's dialogue out of nowhere, prompted by nothing. Okay, Fenris lives over he Nope, over here. Fenris, help me get to your house. God damn it. I want to talk to you. Hi. So the Seneschal's tax collector. What are you doing here? Around again, like you asked. Funny story. I'll pass, but thank you for the help. Spoil sport. Why you want to squat up here in Hightown is beyond me. Because it's. I nice. like the view. So do I. Hey, hey, no. Y you Three stop. Years. There's still no sign of Denarius. I'm beginning to wonder if he's finally given up. This is his mansion, isn't it? He must know you're here. Would you be surprised to learn that it isn't, in fact, his mansion? It belongs to a Tevinter merchant, one who has evidently given up on the place. Perhaps he is dead. Perhaps Denarius killed him. Well, you Either told way, me it was his mansion. if Denarius is aware of my presence, he has done nothing. Isn't this what you wanted? Yes, but... Tell me, what do you do when you stop running? You take a breath and look around. And start anew. I don't know how. My first memory is receiving these markings. The lyrium being branded into my flesh. The agony wiped away everything. Whatever life I had before I became a slave, it's lost. I shouldn't trouble you with this. My problems are not yours. Oh, hey. Yeah, that's clever. I might be able to help with your problems. I'll give you a few more. <laughs> You're such a bad <laughs> a flirt few. with Fenris. It depends if I really work at it. Tempting. You're a handsome man, Hawk. Oh, well, thank you, Fenris. Is there no one else who has your attention? <laughs> I don't know. I, I think I'm. I think I want to romance him. So yeah. Do you see anyone else here? Isabella, but she's gross. An living in a borrowed mansion. None of those things bother you. And I'm a refugee as well as a human. Does that bother you? You have me there. You raise an interesting point. I'll have to consider it. I only got five points from that. What's that? Why are you all slumpy, Fenris? All right. Didn't I? Wasn't there two speaking to Fenris's? Or is that just something else? There is two. Well, I should talk to other people first. Okay, let's go talk to Meryl or Varric, somebody. Let's go talk. How do we get out of your house, Fenris? Fenris, please help me. Oh god. Um Let's go talk to Varric. What the That's not the pub. Who are you? Who are you? I don't like you. Boop. Well, look who's here. Oh. I knew it. It turns out we'll need to do this the hard way, hard So you would rather die? I you owe me if I have to tear your mansion apart brick by brick. 
Ah, uh, it's so not a good idea. An ambush would get you what you want. I consider going after your mother, but no. I prefer the direct approach. And you're gonna die. Boys, let's make this quick. I want to be in that mansion within the hour. Too bad, you're gonna be dead in the hour. No, I don't think so. Right in the face. And my dog. Excuse me. That's very rude of you. Oh. Uh, da, 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 Everybody gets a arrow in the face. Excuse me. I'll shoot you. Okay, you know what? Uh, I don't have any abilities yet. I'll just shoot these guys from afar. Oh, they're dead. Wait, Fenris, where are you going? Oh, there's more. Fenris. I would like some abilities, please. Oh, there's one. Boop. Boop. Okay, that was not what I wanted at all, but okay. What are you doing? Can you just do the thing I want you to do? Fenris, what's going on with you? It's very dramatic, Fenris. Okay. Um... It's like one dude. Oh, he's... No, that's Varric. <laughs> Sorry, I can't tell doors apart. Stop hurting Fenris. Quit it. Jerkus. Well, that's what you get for trying to take my house and scare my mom. Is that it? Where even am I? What are these birds? No, no, pause. Wait. Where am I? What map is this? Is there anything here to loot? Hey, stuff to loot. Give me that. I don't want this nonsense. Give me this. There we go. Where, where even am I? Like, like seriously, where is this place? Okay, I was already up there. Can leave up here. Nothing over there. Okay, I want to go to the pub this time. Yes, pub. I want to go to the pub. Okay, I have Varric with me, so let's talk to Varric. Hi, Varric. What's up? Just tell me if you hear more rumblings from the Coterie about protection. Blondie's got enough trouble. Anders, really? Let me ask you something, Hawk. Do I like you Anders? No. High town. I'd expect <laughs> anyone else to get complacent, but you, you must have plans. I don't know. No plans yet. I'm simply trying to look out for my mother. After everything that happened with Bethany, that's probably good thinking. Hey, don't bring to be that honest, up. I thought there might be a chance you'd want to go back to Ferelden now that things have calmed down. I kind of live it's here now, dude. You're sticking around. I can never leave you. That sounds like a flirt option. I'm just going to use what it. What would I do without my trusty dwarf? I'd cry myself to sleep without you. Dude, what are you doing over there in the oh, corner? Don't get all teary-eyed on me, Hawk. You know <laughs> I can't stand to see a human cry. Why can't Varric so, be a romance? We've got a whole city state full of trouble to get into. Shall we get started? I mean, they've got like a bromance going on. Oh, I got 10 points from that. Okay, that codex. What 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 up is a codex? Okay, visit Anders. I don't want to. Um Aveline. Is it well, oh god, Isabella's here. Where? Are you just talking to yourself? Who are you? Oh. This one? 
less talkative than years, man. Don't you see? Shut Never up! Oh my god! Oh, Isabella, what are you and your boobs you know, up to? to it's like you haven't moved in three years. <laughs> it's easier for people to find me this way. Do you remember the relic oh I told you about? Oh my god. The one I need to find? Yeah, sorta. I've I don't really care. Me. I'm so close I can taste it. Do you want to have sex with it? Isn't that what you said last time? Oh, you mean when I went digging for that stash? Yes, that turned out to contain several badly written poems and an old boot. <laughs> it Not surprised about the boot. Contained the relic. I just thought I'd let you know that I may soon be taking you up on that offer of help. No, I don't want to flirt with you. Gross. And here I was hoping you'd forgotten. If I learn anything new, you'll be the first to hear about it. Oh, yay, Isabella. How are my friendships, by the way? I think I'm pretty good with... Uh, I'm okay with Fenris. Ugh, slightly better than before. Hey, Varric's my bro. Um, I promise. If I go back there, I won't be alone. Okay, what if I switch my party? Boop boop. Check my friendships with these people. Oops, okay, so I really just don't like is I like her less than Anders. I like Anders very very little. Oh, look at how good a friend I am with Meryl. Ah, yeah, about the same level as Aveline. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, that's no good. Okay, well, I'm gonna level these people up anyway. Okay. Uh, now let's go visit Meryl. low <laughs> Uh, uh? Oh, I'm outside the pub. I was like, where am I? Okay, the alienage is this away. I wonder if I can visit my old house. Probably not. You could not. get another cat, you know. There's one in the oh. low town market with a litter of kittens ready to wean. Aww. You don't pay attention to Templars, Canari, or politics, but you notice kittens. Templars, <laughs> quinari, and politics don't meow and attack your feet when you're buying food. Are there any tabbies? I'd like a tabby. Oh my god. I actually like Meryl and Anders' conversations. They're cute. My house is just... Oh no, it's still here. Oh, I can actually go in here. I... D okay. Didn't mean to. I don't want to visit my uncle. Unless I can kill him. Oh, hey. You don't get to live in here, so in the high town. Here's muttering at me. What's through animal. here? Could I ever go through here before? There is nothing in here. Can't go through that door. Okay, what is the point of this? Why did I get into attack mode? That was weird. Why am I in attack mode? How could you put that away? <sighs> Thank Why you. Do you like me? I must seem so dull. Oh, Meryl. This on? Your life has been so exciting. The adventures, the duels, the passionate love affairs. Compared to that, my life is a stale, dry biscuit. Oh. I wish I had your life. No, you don't want my life. Why? Because you have a good heart, and you deserve better. A stale, dry biscuit. Meryl. Precious biscuit. Too good for this world. Okay. Um. Ooh, a shiny. I... Duh. 
Who wants that? Well, you know what? I'll just take it so that I don't forget that I've done this and then I'll sell it. Any other things around here? Any more junk? More colorful pebbles or scarves or tattered pantaloons? Oh yeah, you were a quest. Uh, nothing? 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 Wait, was that a thing or is that a fire? No, it's a fire. Okay, Merle lives in here? I think it's been a long time since so I've actually gone to her house. Okay, let's talk to you. Hi, Meryl. Oh, apparently I'm just waiting for her. Have you heard from your sister? Is she settling in or It's been three years! I thought you and Bethany didn't get along. Did they Why not? Are you worrying over her? I'd be terrified in her shoes, surrounded by strangers, watched all the time. We didn't always agree, but she's a sweet girl. I would never wish that fate on anyone. I guess I never really had them in the party that together that often. Uh, let's. Our not mother be checks sarcastic. on her frequently. She seems to be adjusting. Maybe it's nice for her to finally live without hiding. She's strong. If anyone can get through this, she can. Don't blame yourself. Mm. Someone's got to blame me. Other than my mother, I mean. <laughs> I'm sure your mother doesn't blame you. Oh, Things will yes, be all she right. does. Somehow. That was it? That was all I got to say to her? I didn't even get a flirt option with her. Not that I'm... I, I don't know. I think I'm romancing Fenris at this point. But what is this, Meryl? Meryl, what is this? Meryl. Answer me. By the dread wolf! Why is my house always such a mess when people are here? It's clean sometimes, I swear. It doesn't look that messy, except what's this? Anders. Anders, you okay? Y you handling this, this whatever this is? Okay, let's talk to our nearer, nearer, nearer. Oh my god, just let me. Oh, I could have jumped to Meryl's house. Can I just, I just want to go to the alienage, please? Like, I don't want to... There you are, hi. You've had many lovers, haven't you? Fewer than some think. But you never stay with them. Meryl, no, don't encourage why should I? her. But the act of lovemaking is so... intimate. I don't make love. What I do is only skin deep, kitten. Don't worry your pretty little head about it. Let's talk to you, because you're here. I was hoping you'd come. You did so much for my Fenriel already, but... I visited him among the people, but he turned me away. I know the demons still plague him. And yeah, he wrote to me about taken it. taken him. Two days ago, Fenriel went into a nightmare and hasn't returned. Uh, okay. He can't be woken up? The Keeper says he is near death. His lips still fog a mirror, but that is all. I guess that's a way to tell if someone's Surely there alive. are mages who can pursue him in the Fade. I have contacted Keeper Marathari. The Dalish have an ancient ritual that might help. Then why don't they do but it? it requires someone Fainriel trusts to enter the oh. Fade to free him. Oh, God. So you're, what, hoping I can yell really loudly in his ear? Maybe give him a good shake? I'm hoping you can reach him. You made a strong impression when you rescued him from the slavers. So he trusts me. Tell me. He speaks of you all the time. The Keeper says Fainriel's powers are a throwback to ancient magics that once let elves shape the Fade. The only way to reach him is through his dreams. How would such a magic work? I am no mage. Neither am I. Only I. Know the Keeper said it was a power greatly feared by the Tevinter Magisters. Oh, gosh. Well, all right. Could use a nap. It is not enough for you to dream. You must enter the Fade as a mage does. Can I just bring all Maritari my mage friends? Is coming to perform the ritual that will bring two Fainu now, actually. Back. His childhood things here will help anchor him. Are you willing to submit to her magic to save my son? Oh, Jesus. What does the ritual entail? 
The Keeper can explain it better than I. Her ritual will send you into the Fade. Once there, I imagine you face down the demons until Fainriel regains control of himself. Well, this sounds fun. He'll be unable to return from the Fade until he does. Who agrees to this nonsense except me in a video game? I've made worse deals. Frolic through dreams? Sounds like an experience. I'm game. You just want a sex dream. You'll need someone experienced in the Fade to come with you. <sighs> Gross, I've Anders. already called for the Keeper. We need to begin the ritual as quickly as possible. Wait, I don't want to go with these people. Would you like Can... to stay here or return when she arrives? I'll come back later. I've got a few things to finish first. Yes, I suggest you settle your affairs. Once you are in the Fade, the only way to emerge is with my son. I mean, like, Anders is okay, but I don't want no Isabella with me. No, no, no. I don't even know if I'm doing this quest right now. Oh, uh, gosh. What... Uh... This is a side quest? What quest is this? Oh, it's this one. Okay. So I don't even have to do it. Oh, gross. Okay, I should finish visiting all my friends first. Evelyn and Anders. I don't know why I had to visit Penrith twice. I'll do that later. Um, let's go and visit Anders. <laughs> What will Anders have to say this time? What hypocritical thing? How do I get out of here? Uh, I can get out of here down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I do. Oh, I can just jump there. Sweet. Okay, I should be nice to him. Because we should be friends. Even if I don't like you. It's not a pretty home, but at least it's clean. Is it? I don't know. Let's talk to you. And that will, uh... Pajama Man! Stop the itch. Oh, God. Yes. Pajama Man has an infection. Though I would stay away from women you meet in the port. Pirates tend to... dock in unsavory places. Hey, 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 Isabella. I heard that. Hey, 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 Just use the salve if it comes back. Uh, excuse me. Pajama Man! Things just keep getting worse. Oh, what's up, I had Anders? Templars practically on my doorstep the other night. No, ew, no. Okay. Um. The Templars are hunting you. Not me specifically. They were just checking the refugee camps. But it's not like this place is a secret. It's only a matter of time. <sighs> no, I don't want to know about you. I can't say you've been keeping a low profile. The Knight Commander is out of control. Even her own people have been talking about it. The curfews, the midnight raids on mages' families. Everyone I know forced into hiding so they won't be made tranquil. Is this flirting again? God damn it. Uh, let's be nice to is him, I guess. Is that making it harder for you, with justice? In the Fade, there is no time. Emotion rules everything. Justice doesn't know how to sit idle until the right moment to strike. And I can't say I have any Because you're basically great possessed, dude. I fear what my anger is made of, my friend. <sighs> I'm not going to be mean to him. I, it, this seems like a nice option, but sometimes when I pick it, he says asshole things, so I don't know. You chose to merge with him. Only you can make it work. I am trying. I have not attacked the Templars openly. I've helped the mages here as best I can, but this impasse cannot last. One day, everyone in Kirk will, will have to choose a side. I probably didn't get any friendship from that. Oh, I did. Oh, five points. Oh, good. We are not. You still look like Varric in your icon. Oh, we're getting better. I don't know. I don't like you, and I really don't like you, and neither does Hawk. <laughs> Yay, Meryl! Okay. Um, so now let's go say hello. Oh, wait. Let me change my party first. If I'm going to go into the Fade, let's pick uh, not you. You. I actually like you guys as a team. Yo, Fenris. Sup? 
Even though we're helping I'm wandering here by accident sometimes when I'm trying to get home from the market. Really? A scary place. Well, not that bad. We've been in worse places, Meryl. Places with, you know, dragons. What does this look at? Oh, the ocean. That's kind of cool. Okay, I don't know if... Uh, I don't know if Fenris is a good order or whatever. But that's okay, we're just gonna go talk to Aveline right now, so... Just gonna catch up on my friends. Right, this is leaving, right? I do not. Wasn't my party talking? You okay, should have bye. lived in Tevinter. Nope. You'd be happier there. You're probably right. There, your magic would be a mark of honor. Apprentice to the right magister, you would do well. Is there a downside? Only They're if evil? you're bothered by owning a few slaves and performing the occasional blood ritual. So they all do those things. Just the ones who don't complain about how powerless and persecuted they are. I like this guy checking us out over here. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let me leave. Okay, Aveline. Uh, okay. Let's go talk to Aveline. Even though Good she already am. I've been waiting all day. You've been waiting for three years. Three years. Don't think you're ever getting in to see that guy. Whoa, where the hell's Aveline? Oh, she's in the, this room? Ah. Yo, sup, Aveline? We'll need to give them answers by tomorrow, Captain. I'll have them. Dismissed. The Seneschal was particularly vocal. Dismissed. My ascot says get out of here. You'd think the Captain of the Guard could requisition a Templar or two, but no, that would be demeaning. Can't have them working for the people when Eternity needs a nanny. Oop. That's why I remain unimportant. Less pressure. As if the return of the Amels hasn't set Hightown on its ear. As long as it's off its ass. <laughs> sure, have your fun. But the coin you poured into Kirkwall tipped what balance there was. Really? I didn't realize I was making it worse by getting ahead. I'm just harassing you. Thanks, Aveline. Although you Aveline. are a bit like the center of a hurricane. You've changed fortunes for many people. Not always for the better. Well, some people are jerks and I need to kill them. Sounds like you're spreading yourself pretty thin. There are a lot of people in my charge. Someone has to look out for them. Get rid of that ass. You guard please. the guardsmen. I don't turn people loose like Jevon. There's additional training. Doubled patrols. Costs are up, but I've halved injuries. I'll take it and argue with Seneschal Bran later. After the last Jevin? captain, you couldn't Oh, have he was the last guy. Easy. That's right. At least God, it's I hard had to the remember all these people. On my side. Once they understood, they rallied. And those who didn't weren't fit to hold the crest. Stack friends against the enemies. I don't know if I came out ahead, but it's for the better. I don't Grouse know. all you want, but the Aveline I know doesn't regret a second as captain. They'd have to drag me out of here. And I'm sure some are lining up to try. You among them, I bet. What? Haven't had much time to follow you around. I don't want to be captain Not that no I guard. Need to. I can trust that you at least try to do right. So I'm with you if you need me, Hawk. Sort of. Oh, Just hey, I got some points. I like some points. Oh wait, you're not in my party, so I can't check on our friendship. Ah, no. Okay. Um. Again, this is weird. Should should I should I do this? Where can the gallows air shock? Underground Railroad, jeez. I guess I should just do the Night Terrors thing, but um, I will do that next time since getting my house and checking up on my friends took almost an hour of playtime. So, uh, yeah. I will do Night Terrors next time. So, thank you all for watching, and I hope you come back and watch more Dragon Age 2.
Bye.